know you guys Liliana from vanilla and canela here welcome back to my channel and to another video I left you right here in this moment right now in my last video and basically for you it's been a few days for me a few seconds I have just come back home had a busy morning today I um, had to go get a few bits top up spend another 50 euros I'm going to show you all that I got and I also went to a farmacia farmacia in Portuguese farmacia chemist pharmacy uh, I managed to get my hands on this I love this I my mom used this has used this for years she still does um, here it's 18 euros 45 I'll let you know because this is um this has got um, a color see like there and it's 50 sun sun cream crema colorata colored cream so yeah and i also got these 11 euros 15 is a bit steep but the pharmacist told me that this is a very good hay fever tablet and i've run out of all my uk ones so i wanted to make sure that i had this and by the way i bought some us ones when I tell you that I zonked out the two times I had it, I couldn't understand why. I was out of it. I was so tired. It was obviously a really drowsy one. So I'll only take that if I ever, if I'm going to bed, if that makes sense. But anyway, the guys told me that um, this is non drowsy. Brilliant. I popped a Dodica just to get a few bits and um, it spiraled into this. Let me show you what I got. Just in case you are curious. Oh. 55.05. This is what I got. There is a couple of things that are expensive. Uh, but anyway, I got some bread. This bread is 154. It's the tartaruga bread. I would love to know why they put five it's always five. You can buy two or five. Usually it's six, isn't it? Half a dozen. I don't know. I'd just love to know if there's a reason for it. Anyway, five. I also got some more plum cakes as well as these little breads. This was three euros 19. I thought it was like 2 99 so it's only 20 cents more, but Alex loves these. And basically now Alex does not have lunch at school. He has a snack mid-morning and then he not has watch my previous video i mentioned it he's on summer school hours so he finishes every day at 1 p.m um, but yeah so he never has a snack in the morning even though he is allowed to and i've actually had a teacher once say to me at his previous school um would it be possible to send alex a snack for him to have mid-morning and i was like yeah, he doesn't want it. He does not want it. So he makes me look bad because, you know, the teacher probably asked him, why aren't you having a snack? And he probably said, because my mum didn't give me one. But that's untrue because he never wants to have a snack. But now, I mean, I read him, as we would say in Portuguese, Rezele os amens, which is, I, uh, what, how would that translate? I prayed... With, I prayed amens on him, which means basically it's, uh, I'm trying to think of a English version of that, but I can't right now. But it's basically, I read him the riot act. It's kind of the same thing. You know, I was like, if you don't eat your sack in the morning, you're going to get in trouble because obviously he's not going to be eating until half one because by the time he gets off the bus, he needs a snack. So he did eat it yesterday. Sorry to go wandering off on that one. He loves these. I'm happy. I, for me, the most important thing with Alex is that he eats. Anything he eats, I'm like happy about. So yeah, I got him some more of those. Eggs, we needed desperately. This is the reason why I wanted to go to Dodica. We bought these last week or the week before. These were amazing. These were fantastic flavor. Paul and Alex were like, more, more, more. So, <laughs> so I got two. I'll pop them in my freezer downstairs. So there's what? How many? Um, there's quite a, 
a lot in there. But anyway, some wipes. I got this jam, Frutti di Boschi Forest Fruits, okay, uh, which is berries, basically. Um, yeah, got some of that. Got some flour. It's the first flour I've bought here. Uh, tipo 00, so 00, zero um, flour. I got some coffee, not because I need it, but if I don't grab a couple, next time I go, there won't be any, and then I won't have any. So these are 3 99 so I grabbed a couple. I also got this drink. Alex really liked this. Um, it's got chunks. Um, so, um, and he liked it, so I bought him another one as a treat. I'll put it aside and when I think um, he needs a little. It might actually up. be this afternoon, you guys, because I got a call from the school that um, he bumped himself doing PE on the head with a bottle, I'm not sure if it was him, like with a water bottle or another kid running past him or something like that. They basically said he's fine, but we wanted to let you know, of course, but he, in, just in case he gets a headache to keep an eye on him. So he might need a little treat. I also got this, love the name of mosquitoes in Italian, Zanzare, Zanzare, love that, love that. I think that's one of my favorite words now. Um, I got this, all the Brits said this was really good. All the Brits here, sorry, uh, our community. So I got this because me and the kids are getting bitten to death. Paul, not one, not one bite. Um, also got these um, for Paul and Alex. They love this kind of stuff cold. Um, I got the one without lactose because why not? And then I got this. I actually realized that this is muesli and I usually have granola, but we'll see. It looked good anyway. That was for this tiny little box, 270. Um, so yeah, uh, for this, let me, let me find out. I'll find out how much this was and I'll put it on the screen. But I thought this was it. I got another couple of bags, so, so let me... I open. got two packs of wipes. These are $2.69 uh, a bag, which is the cheapest I've found so far. And there's 14 in each. They're not my favourite. They're really big and bulky, but, you know, he's only going to pee and poo in them, so it's fine. Um, yep. Yeah. I also got some crisps, our favourites. I got this little salad... I already have another salad available, so just as a top up. Two things of pineapple yogurt, ananas. In Portuguese it's ananas, but um, here I think is ananas, I don't know. Anyway, continuing. I also got two things of butter. So just these were like five euros for the two, but one is for our day to day butter and the other one I might be making some uh, lemon curd so yeah I need some more and then I got just some cheese I went for Edam just price wise it was like the most reasonable is for a chunk like this it's like five or six pounds it's six euros I just want something for sandwiches I'm not looking for anything like to make like a cheese board or anything like that it's just day to day so that was it it is uh, quarter to 12 so I'm going to quickly put this away and get some lunch going for me and Paul Ozzy's in nursery in case you're wondering he did cry a little bit it was sweet because I was standing outside you know just on leaning against the wall to see if he would stop crying and I didn't see this mum coming up because I was just like in my own space and she put her hand on my arm and said they'll stop really quick. Don't worry, it gets better really quick. And I thought, thank you, thank you, you know, because you worry. So anyway, let me put this away. And um, yeah, I'll speak to you soon. Hello you guys, it's the next day. I'm here in my kitchen. Ozzy's here as well, so if you hear that noise, you know. The dishwasher is on as well, and I'm about to make some lemon curd. I thought I would show you a little bit. It's a little bit different. If you have a Thermomix 
and you've done that before you know how easy it is um sorry i'm just boiling a couple of jars this recipe makes a couple of jars so perfect let me show you what do you need what you need is sugar butter eggs lemons and that's basically you use the rind of one lemon and the juice of three to five i'm going to get this one's probably worth three it's about 150 grams of juice um but 120 of butter i think it's 240 of sugar so i'm going to use the zest of this one i don't know maybe i don't want to put too much zest i would say that is a big lemon okay <laughs> that's a bit smaller i've already used some of that definitely going to use the juice of that but anyway if you haven't got a thermomix there's plenty of recipes online for this um, it's a bit more time consuming because i think you probably have to start if you have a thermomix i just went on to cookie dough and got a recipe super super easy okay um so this is what i use get my lemon peel I love using this it works really well the sugar and the lemon together the smell you guys oh my god it's just incredible just incredible next we're gonna add 120 grams of butter So now we're going to add the lemon juice. I need 150 grams. I'm going to put this um, um, and let's see how much we've got. This will keep all the pips. So we've got 130. I'm going to crack that one open. Hold on. Okay, so another half a lemon did the job. I'll take this out now and um, there we go. Eggs are in. I'm going to put the top on with no um, cup and we're going to do 20 minutes, 20 minutes, 90 temperature and then speed two. Tidy this up, and in the meantime, the um, the jars. Let me show you. I'm just drying here. Put them in here so it's nice. Look, it's already dry. Beautiful. Making sure the lids dry up as well. There, I've tidied up. Here's the curd 
going. As you can see it's been going for six minutes. The dishwasher just finished. I actually didn't put it on last night because it wasn't full. So this morning I added the um, breakfast stuff and just I've just done it. It finished. I've opened it so it doesn't have to use the dry function. It can just dry naturally, save a bit of energy. Yeah, everything is tidy. Here's our seat. I got my new vacuum yesterday. I've been waiting for so long. I ordered it almost two weeks ago. Well, two weeks is over, over dramatic, but maybe a week and a half. I ordered it at the same time as the dishwasher, but it only came yesterday. And last night, I put it on. And I actually said to Paul, hmm, it's not very dirty because I'd already vacuumed uh, that morning. But I've just taken out the recipient and I want to see what's inside. Right, guys, look at all the stuff that it picked up from my clean floor. Just a downstairs. Incredible, isn't it? Look at that. So we just finished. We're now going to put the lid on 25 seconds at speed 6. Okay, guys, I'm just going to get the sides. It looks and smells incredible. I'm just going to put it into the jars. Hold okay. on a second. Now it says lids on. So let me do this one. And there we are. It lasts, let me check how long it lasts, up to a month uh, in the fridge. So I'm just going to let it cool completely and then put it in the fridge and I'll make labels for that later. Mm -hmm. You want to try some lemon curd? It looks incredible. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You guys, for lunch today, it's just going to be bread butter with lemon curd on it looks and tastes incredible